place a firewood here. And then we'll get a quick sparky. Right, stay clear. And there we go. Perfect. Oh, that's, that's much better. I can feel my legs again. Uh, maybe it wasn't such a bad idea to stand in front of an empty fireplace for so long. Uh, hello. My name is Matt, and this is my friend Sparky. Uh, I'm Blinky. Thanks for lighting up this chimney. You you guys appeared just in time. <laughs> I'm flattered. I, I don't want to sound rude, but I think I've never seen you around. Uh, are you new guests? Well, we just arrived, so I guess we are? Actually, I came from a place that looks pretty similar to this one. If you don't mind me asking, what happened here? Uh, I planned a tea party for my friends, yes, and I was afraid they wouldn't make it, and uh, as you can see, no one showed up. I I'm really sorry, Blinky. I bet they have an explanation for that. Yeah, I'm sure they didn't do it on purpose. You think? The worst part is that I don't even have my best friend here. I miss him. It feels like ages since I last saw him. It may sound silly, but I don't feel safe without him in this huge place. I'm sorry, guys. I'd like to have the courage to find him, but I just can't. So I just stayed here. Oh, Blinky, it's gonna be okay. I'm sure there's something we can do to make you feel better. Actually, I just thought of something. Let's have the... Let's actually have the tea party. The three of us, right now, will be your guests. R really? Do you really want to? I'm a bit worried, because I'm short of food. I don't want to be a bad host. You see, each of my friends were going to bring something, but since they didn't come, uh, I only have tea. I'm sorry to bother. I'm sorry to bother you, but do you think you could bring something to eat for our party? Oh, <laughs> well, we didn't think about that. We didn't have anything for the party. Uh, don't worry, that it's okay. There are ingredients around the house you could use to make a carrot sandwich. Carrot sandwich? Uh, does that taste any good, Matt? I don't really like vegetables, but let's give it a try. We'll make the best sandwich you've ever had. But, uh, we don't have a recipe. I, I keep one on the kitchen table. It's always there in case my memory fails. It's my favourite treat, you know? Take this carrot. It's from a special harvest for my special guests. For such a special occasion. I'm sure you'll find the rest of the ingredients if you search well. Alright, well, here we go again. I'll be here waiting. Don't forget to bring the sandwich. Oh, finally, there we go. I was, I was hoping it wouldn't say it again, or I wouldn't have to do even more dialogue. Our bread is the best in the universe. How many do you want? Just one would be great. It'll take too long to will it take too long to revive here? Wait a moment. Lucky you, you qualify for a free order. Isn't that an amazing deal? Wow, how convenient. <laughs> wow, for free? But how am I supposed to receive my order? Your order will arrive in three three days? Two? One. Order delivered. We left your order inside your bedroom. Thanks for your preference. And remember, if it isn't fresh, it isn't bread. That was... strange. Well, it's not actually in my bedroom, isn't it? I better go there before someone else eats it. I am unconcerned about this circumstance. I still can't believe they delivered it immediately. It's so strange and convenient at the same time. And where's the basket? I only saw I only saw bread. Where's the basket gone? Come on, give me the basket. Now nah, anyway, um, and to equip the screwdriver, I can use the screwdriver to move the batteries from the robot. I'm sorry, Mr. Robot, but batteries are a really useful thing to have around. We have committed murder in the name of furthering our goals. That did not feel right. I promise I'll make it up to you. Well, this is going to stick with me forever. I'm just permanently scarred now. Okay, well, um, I think that we can do everything, actually. Just a moment. 
Wait, I don't remember. So, let the cauldron cook carrot. Okay, yeah, that makes more sense, actually. I was like, I'm not gonna lie, I, video game logic, I was just thinking we put both the bread and the carrot in and then it would work. Time to cook the carrot. On second thought, don't you think that liquid has a strange colour? Well, as long as it gets cooked. Okay, the carrot's in. Now we wait. Three, two, one, and it's done. Yes, that doesn't look like poison at all. One step closer to Blinky's carrot sandwich. Wait, um, combine with this. I can cut the bread with this knife. Great, now I can start making the sandwich. Wise bread. Combine these two. I finally got everything ready. I just put the cooked carrot inside the bread and it's ready. There we go. Uh, I might need to equip it. That smell! I recognize it anywhere! Wow, you made such a gourmet looking carrot sandwich. Most people don't get that colour right the first time. Oh, thanks, we put a lot of effort into it. Alright, we're all set then. We can officially begin the tea party. Wow, everything looks great. It really does. I wish I could taste it. It's all thanks to the both of you and that carrot sandwich you prepared. Uh, I wasn't a fan of tea or carrots, but today has made me change my mind. That was great. Would you like more, Matt? Yeah, please. Hey, Blinky, can I ask you something? I'm really curious to get to know you more. Sure, feel free to ask me anything. Okay, so... What do you like to do? Of all the things I like to do, the one I enjoyed the most was gardening with my best friend. There's a garden in this house that I always enjoyed g uh, growing with the help of my best friend. We used different seeds and grew unique plants. You can find lots of those trees inside the house too. I hope you get to see them. Hmm, impressive. Where can I find them? The house is uh, really big, so we took advantage of it and planted them in several rooms. Sadly, I don't know why most of the rooms are locked. That's a shame. I hope I'm able to see a guardian work soon. And what about you? What do you like to do? Hmm, I'm a big fan of solving mysteries. I love playing with my sister, we solve mysteries and puzzles that we make up in our house. We call that game the Night Explorer. Sometimes we stay up late at night, making up stories and hiding objects around the house. Hmm, that sounds really fun. Could I play with you sometime? Of course, we can play with Sparky too. I'm good with fire, but I don't need to practice to be such a good mystery solver like you. Sparky, you're learning super fast, and you're helping me out so much. The sad thing is that now I can't find my sister. Have you by any chance seen her, Blinky? Uh, I'm sorry to hear that, but I haven't seen her. Don't worry, I'm sure we'll find her, and then we can go back to having fun together. Like playing video games. In our favourite video game, we explored an ancient ruins to, ad to obtain secret treasures. I enjoy playing games too. I'm sure we have a cartridge somewhere around the house. Really? Wow, I really want to play now. Okay, so... Do you like living in here? I've always been afraid in here, but I used to feel more secure having my best friend by my side. What are you afraid of? Recently I have this feeling that something is watching us. It's becoming more intense every day. I hate feeling like this. I think this place is getting more somber day after day. I miss the days where we were all together. We were like a family. I know what you mean. We'll try and help you while we're here. If I could find my best friend, everything would improve. Oh, sorry, Blinky. So, enough about me. How's life at your house? It's always been my sister and me having fun together. I try my best to make her happy. But, recently... Mum and Dad are arguing a lot. It's been tough for us, but Emma is struggling the most. I found her crying so many times. Sometimes I just don't know what to say to her. Still, she knows she can count on me. I'll protect her from anything. Hmm, I really hope your parents can solve their problems. Yeah, it must be hard for everyone in your house. Thanks, guys. I really hope things get better soon. Okay, so... Who is your best friend? Tell us more about them. Who is he? Oh, uh, my, my best friend is a 
Bear, who's always been by my side. We were inseparable. Until one day that I couldn't find him anymore. Since then I've become more fearful than ever. I don't know how he did it, but he always made me feel safer. I, m I miss hugging him and having tea parties with him all the time. I'm sorry, Blinky. I can tell how much you miss him. D do you have a best friend? Yeah, my best friend in the entire world is my sister, Emma. Emma always helps me when I have a problem, and I'm also there for her when she needs me. Before I arrived here, I was helping her get her teddy bear back. Actually, she reminds me of you. She also feels safe yet. She also feels safer when she has her bear friend by her side. I don't remember if this was in the demo, because I remember like you had to put. I I don't know. Maybe I'm misremembering, but I thought you had to think about it a bit more to figure out like connect the dots here. But you've probably already done it now with that line especially. Um, yeah, it's um, it's not gonna be quite a person. Emma and you have a lot in common. You would really get along. Hmm. It it seems like it. I really want to meet her now. I hope she likes me. Oh, of course she would. Hey Blinky, it was great getting to know each other more. Oh, thanks for coming for my tea party. You made me feel much better. I'm glad we could help. Uh, about your best friend. I see how much he means to you. Did you try looking for him? I looked around the house, but I wasn't able to investigate in some rooms. Uh, I'm really afraid to keep exploring it all by myself, so I just stayed here. Hey, Blinky, you're not alone anymore. We can help you find him. Would you do that for me? Of course, we're friends now, right? I light up every corner of this house until we find your friend. Thanks. Yeah, you guys are really great. I think this might help you on your mission. An alarm clock. One of my friends usually falls asleep in the worst possible places. I can promise you that this alarm will wake up even the most stubborn sleeper. This is super useful, thanks. Hey, but take a look. Batteries aren't included. Oh, sorry, I don't have them. There must be something that uses batteries around the house. I think there's a tool in the basement that'll help you get those batteries from something else. Please, find him, and bring him back to me. Okay, so never mind, this is how you use the batteries. I wasn't sure if... Yeah, I, I remember the, the, how to get the batteries, but I don't remember what, how you were supposed to use them, but... Hey, we kind of got ahead of things here. Just a second, it's ready. There we go, alarm clock. And then we can equip that, and you can probably already see where this is going to be useful. Oh yeah, now it's making me think, damn, like, I, I didn't even put two and two together. It looks like you're gonna need to get a disc to wake him up, but instead we use this. Uh, I'm sorry, I don't want to ruin your sleep, but I have to wake you up. Uh, hello, Mr. Uh, dog. I'm sorry for waking you up, but I really need you to visit- But I really need to visit my sister's room. Oh, was I in your way? I'm so sorry, this is all my fault. I promise I won't bother you again. Uh, did I say something wrong? Wait, uh, okay, I got weirdly stuck on that. Is that homework? Huh, how can someone do homework here? Oh, Fluffy, you're here too. Are you, our, are you really our Fluffy? Hmm, Mr. Lucky looks quite different here, so, but you stayed the same. Blinky said his best friend was a bear, right? Could Fluffy be his best friend? It seems so. I don't see any other bear around here. Well, plush or not, this bear means a lot to him. Man, Blinky will be really happy. I don't remember having... I don't remember my sister having a lock covering covered in ice. <laughs> Wait, covered in ice. I wonder what's inside. Please, leave me alone. Huh? The dog is inside the closet? Wait, hang on a minute. In ice? I don't remember this, but let's see. Yeah. Uh, oh. Made sense to me, but I guess not. <sighs> I left Emma sleeping with Fluffy before I woke up here. I thought I could find her here. Where could she be? I hope she's okay. This is exactly the same nightstand alarm clock my sister has in her room. I don't get it. Why do some things look so similar, and some of them seem so different? This looks like my house from the outside, but this one looks even bigger. 
These look very similar to Emma's coloring books. She loves to draw and color with her crayons. I'm always impressed. She even stays in the lines. Alright then. Oh yes, um... Equip that. Blinky, we have something for you. Close your eyes. And... Look who's back. I thought you ne I'd never see you again. Oh, my heart is filled with joy. You've done so much for me and my best friend. I, I feel a warm feeling inside my heart. My best friend by my side. I'm not afraid anymore. Thank you. I want you to have this. There's no reason to take it with me. Golden Key. I don't understand, Blinky. Where are you going? Blinky, are you alright? Okay. Where did he go? Well then, he just he materialized. Well then, we got a golden key. I guess let's equip that. This must be the right key. Let's hope it works. Oh, I actually didn't think I'd get it right first try. Oh, hello. I don't believe I ever got into this room. Hmm, I don't see anything useful. Wait, look, I can see something inside. Oh, you're right, Sparky. Thanks. Another key. Let's see what we can open with this. It looks so similar to my parents' bed. When I was Emma's age, I used to sleep with my parents every time I had a nightmare. But that doesn't happen anymore, because I'm all grown up now. Hmm. Emma loves trying Mom's clothes and modeling them in front of the mirror. She almost sprained her ankle once while wearing Mom's heels, but she still loves trying stuff on. I wonder what's inside. Hmm. Oh, what's this doing here? Oh, we actually got a game cartridge. What's that? It's a video game cartridge. It must be the one Blinky told us about. Okay, I'm almost certain now. I don't think I played this one. Can we find any clues by playing it? Well, there's only one way to know. Let's try it out on a game console and see what we can find. Okay, well, that really convinces me that this must have been not in the demo, because I wasn't sure at first, but I'm pretty sure you couldn't find a cartridge in the demo. So, yeah. Uh, now this definitely stands out. I haven't played the piano in such a long time. Maybe I still remember some notes. Music notes, keyboard. Each, each arrow is a different music note. Combine them and create amazing melodies. Wait, so... So, hang on. Is it just those four notes, then? I'm just seeing how, how well I can work with this. <laughs> so, down is the lowest, then this is... Right, okay. So, you could do, like... Decent. Emma is definitely a better piano player than I am. I should probably learn a nice melody and come back to give it another try. Unfortunately, I guess we only get four notes, but still, it's quite nice. This console seems perfect for trying out the game card we found earlier. Excited. I haven't played a new game in a while. Tower of Asphalt. Wait, is is that supposed to sound like what I think it's supposed to sound like, or am I reading into this a bit too much? Evil creatures are threatening the safety of our kingdom. Oh dear traveller, we need your skills to prevent my people from getting harmed. We will reward you with the sacred melody of our la- oh wow. Okay, yeah, I think I, I, I know where that's going. Please, save the kingdom of Asphor. Wait, is this a tower defense? Oh no no no, but still. That would have been cool. You cannot go diagonal. Okay, good to know. Also, they seem to not care about following the path.
Okay. We've cleared. They're just firing arrows, or is there something else to do? I think it is just firing arrows. This is actually going to get unironically hard, I think, just because it's going to be annoying trying to get the arrows to hit if I can't shoot diagonally. Oh, I thought that guy might take a few more hits. There we go. Thank you, dear traveller. Your heroic act will forever be remembered in our kingdom. Let us reward you with the sacred melody of our land. I swear to god, if it just, like, plays the sound and I'm supposed to know exactly what the notes are just by the sound, I'm gonna lose my mind. Wait, so, so, oh, the fuck, that was too fast, that was too fast, I was, I was, like, looking away because I thought for a second that, mm. God damn it. So, oh, oh, okay, right, it says there. Uh, um, up left, up left, right, down, up, left. Okay, right, I thought, yeah, I would have gotten it wrong, because I thought, uh, from from that glimpse, I thought it was up left, right, down, left, right, but no, it's up left, right, down, up, left. Right, okay. I got it. Yeah. Let's not talk about it. That was a beautiful melody. Maybe playing the piano wasn't that bad. Wait, what was that sound? What the f- <laughs> Okay. Wow. What just happened? I'm not sure. I've never taught me that pianos could do that. Can you take a look inside? We just got like a fucking alien spaceship in here. Wow, I've never seen the inside of a piano before. It has so many interesting parts. Hey look, there's something in here. That's weird. Why would someone hide this inside a piano? Oh, there's the record. What's that for? Well, the music gets recorded in this big round plastic... Oh, it is just big round plastic. Stop. Dadler's collection piece. I should take it with me. It might be useful later. Okay, I know I haven't got through the store yet, because I don't know what's... Wait. Okay, so I have been here, because this is where the demo ended. Interesting. If I remember right, I think this is where it ended. Definitely a room like this. There might be another room in the game that looks like this. This view is amazing. That castle looks very similar to the one I used to visit with my family. Is it common to live in places like that where you came from? No, it's not. But long ago, it was. Dad usually told us stories about how people lived in those times. I have so many good memories of visiting that castle. It's been a while since the last time we went there. Well, let's not think about it too much right now. We need to keep moving f Blech. Looking for an enemy. Well, I'm not being allowed to move, so- oh, there we go. What a beautiful vase. And it's painted in my favourite colour, too. Looks a bit empty, though. I bet Mom will put a flower in there to make it look even better. I wonder what's at the bottom of this well. Hmm, I don't think we can reach it easily from where we're standing. Maybe we could use the handle over there. Okay. Handle's too rusty, we'll budge. I guess we don't have anything right now unless the soap is gonna work, which would be funny. Yeah, okay. <laughs> that would be funny if the soap worked. <laughs> okay. So I'm pretty sure the slope is also an item that wasn't in the demo. Um, and, okay, it's this small key. You know what? Let me see, how long have we been recording? Oh wow. I wasn't sure where I'd get a good cut-off point, so I think we're going to call it there for this episode. But thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. <laughs>